Okay, welcome back, guys. So now we are done with fixing that. We need to export this mesh again. It's not that we have better normal mapping there. Let's export this out because the previous one we exported that. Previous ones we exported. Let me hide this. Previous ones we exported. That is weird issue in here. So <coughs> delete this. And delete this also. So let's export a new one. It's better. Export this out. Think I would. Uh, let me just replace it with the. Let me replace it with this two UV fish base <coughs> instead. So replace that. Okay. Let's bring this in. Where's my file manager? It should be the old one. Delete this. Then two fish bays. Bring this in. Fantastic. Now we have this. What is going on? What in the world is going on? Now we have the same issue again. After exporting this out, we have the same issue. Well, that sucks. Well, I think I'm guessing it's probably a problem from. <clears throat> I'm guessing it's probably a problem from exporting this out. I think the problem is from the exports. It kind of messes up the UVs when you export. Messes up the UVs completely. But that's fine. <clears throat> that's completely fine. I think I'm just going to stick with this piece. I think I'm going to just stick with this. But let's try. Let's try it again one more time. Let me let me import. No, I can't. Ah, <clears throat> uh, it doesn't really matter. I already, I already I already have my UV map, so it shouldn't be a problem. I already have my UV maps. Hmm. I already have my UV maps and my normal maps, so I can use this smooth version and then just apply. And just apply the normal map to it. That should be <coughs> that should be fine. So name this to base. No oh, fish. The eyeball, so the <coughs> uh, no, let's just make let's just make clean now, <coughs> clean now UVs for the eyeball. Let's at least at very least get something a bit cleaner in here. So I'm just going to delete all of this. Let's get something clean in here. Uh, camera base. Use edge mode rather. Select this edge. Select this edge. <clears throat> no, the other edge down. With a closer view in there. Okay, cut, cut, select all of this, and uh, unfold, layouts, mm, select all of this, do an orient layouts. Yeah, <clears throat> should be fine. Go out of 
part of isolate mode. All right. <clears throat> Okay, save this. Uh, let's give this a separate material. New Lambert's built by type history, fish body. Brush probably give us a different color. This is a separate color, separate material rather. Um, fish I mats. Okay, <clears throat> save this. <clears throat> then it's open up Substance Painter. Now select these two. I'll just do exports. Let me drop this outside of this. Be an FBX fish model. Export okay. <clears throat> Close this new select mesh. Import this less hard. The normal map, click OK. We have this in here. I'm trying to smooth UVs for this, I'm trying to smooth numbers for this, not too sure. Anyway, let's drop in let's drop in the normal map for this let's see what we have okay so you can always split down and export out. Let's see. So you can always down and export out the AI as subdivision level. But I think for to for this, it should be fine just for the texture and it should be fine for texture. And maybe or maybe maybe I can duplicate this. Select all the edges. And just do smooth something something edge rather if that really does anything then select all of this again and export it out put this to two exports then I can come here and come here and update this Project configuration selects that actually does anything, well, which it didn't. So, this scenario subdivision level would have been better instead. Anyways, let us carry on with this. So, let's bake, bake this. So, kind of normal. Let's big the fish body first. Under coverture, let's use generate for normal map instead. 
Os de onde não tá com o com o com o normal map. That's a better way to go. And beat this out. Okay, so we have that bit in now. Okay, let's big for the eye. Okay, let's put this in here, apply to all big. Right, <clears throat> that should be fine. Let me just do a quick save for this file. Save this out. I believe we are good to go. So I can always come into the fish body and then intensify the fish balls even more. This uh, the general intensity of the normal map. So I come back to normal map. I'll just reduce this in here so it's not too intense. Something like this should be fine. Yeah, let's save this again. And next tutorial, I'll just go on and then start the texturing process for this piece. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next lesson. Bye for now.